Hello everyone and welcome to the Chameleon Twist tutorial series. This video is just an introduction to the series where I'm going to talk about some important information that you'll need to know. Chameleon Twist makes a great speed game because it's very beginner friendly to learn, but it also has a lot of depth and optimizations at a high level. This series is going to cover level tutorials for both the any% percent and all levels categories. For every section of every level, I'll be going over both the beginner and advanced level strategies to speed them up as well as showing the differences between the U.S. version and the Japanese version of the game. The U.S. version is generally considered the more beginner-friendly, while the Japanese version is the faster version for the any% percent category. However, the U.S. version is definitely faster for the All Levels category, due to a change in Antland that wastes a lot of time. We'll go over that when we get there. Also, if you've never played the game before, you should go into the training room and do the five different sections that it has. They do a very great job of teaching you the mechanics of the game, and those mechanics will be assumed in the rest of this tutorial. If you're looking to purchase a copy of Chameleon Twist, for the US version specifically, there are 1.0 and 1.1 versions. You would like to buy the 1.0 version because the 1.1 patched out a glitch that we use later in the run. The way you can tell by looking at the cartridge is on the back, you see these indented numbers. If there is just two indented numbers, that is a 1.0. If you have two indented numbers and the letter A, that is a 1.1. Some cartridges even have a second revised edition, like Ocarina of Time, where you'll see two numbers and the letter B. But Chameleon Twist only has up to 1.1. So be cautious when you're buying it. Also, if you can't see the back of the cartridge because the sticker gets torn off or something, and you get the chance to play the game before buying it or you have the ability to return it, the easiest way to tell is to run up to these porcupines in the first level and then shoot one out, and you see that gray puff of smoke? That means that this is a 1.0. And on the 1.1 version, it has a little splash of color instead of the, the gray smoke. The Japanese version also has that color splash, and you'll see it in later videos. Like I said before, this is a tutorial covering both the any% percent and all levels routes of this game. For the any% percent route, you'll be doing Jungle Land first, when you start the new game. And then you'll be moving into Bomb Land, then to Kids Land, then to Ghost Castle. For all levels, you have more of a choice, but you will always start with Jungle Land. After that, you unlock both Antland and Bombland, and you can choose to do either one of those first. Say you went to Antland first and completed it, that will unlock Desert Castle and Kids Land. And then, in any order you want, you'll do the next three levels. And then finally, you will end with Ghost Castle. For every level, there's an individual video covering everything there is to know about them to start running the game. But we're always looking to find new strats, too. Also, you may notice a change in my background or clothing for me throughout the series. That's because any time a revision needs to be made, I'll be editing in the corrections or additions into the videos and then re-uploading them. Anyways, you can see the full playlist of the series in the description below, as well as getting a link to the Chameleon Twist speedrunning Discord server and a link to the speedrun.com page. Check out the Discord, we're always happy to help new players. Be sure to leave a thumbs up, subscribe, and comment to make these videos easier to find for those who want them. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoy the Chameleon Twist speedruns.